What's up, everybody, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're wrapping up the Soul Calibur 6 collab on King of Fighters. So, as you can see on here, some of the events you can see is 13 hours later, late, uh, waiting. So, we got a lot of stuff to do still. I haven't really been playing this as much, it's been busy at work and just haven't had the time, guys. But besides that, I am free to play if y'all guys didn't know. But I did get a couple gems up, so we'll do a few pulls, and I'm also they're gonna do our pulls on that other little banner that they gave us. I think I still can get tokens out of it too. I haven't got a lot of them out of it, but uh, where is that at? I skip it. There it is, right there. Okay, we got three thousand tokens, and I might end up getting whatever you get out of this, but you never know. So I'm going to go ahead and try that out. Oh, we got one red orb. I don't know what that was, though, but... Now, I want to say you can get a memory for doing this, too. An Ivy memory. Or was it a free Cassandra? I can't remember. Let's look right here. If we go right here... No, click on that part of it. Yeah, it's the War Maiden Cassandra costume. So I have to get to five, 50 pulls, and uh, right now this would be 40. So I need another 500 to get her unlocked, at least. If you guys didn't know, I only got Taki out of this out of this uh, collab. If you didn't know, you know you can go check out the other video, and you'll see the pull from that. But yeah, we need 10, 5, 50, 500 more coins to make another thousand, and we'll get her unlocked. So I'm gonna be working on doing that the rest of the day. So expect me to have her. I might start doing profile videos of some of my old collab characters and characters in general. I think that'll be something interesting to do. All right, let's see. Do I want to get a soul for her? I would love to get. Since we're getting a regular Cassandra. It really don't matter here about this one, so we might like I might try to go for her uh, special again still, because I still don't have her um, 3PG card. Maybe my luck, I pull a set card here, um, or we can go ahead and go for Song Mina, which I played with her doing a dream match, and she's pretty good like playing with her was pretty fun now, don't get me wrong Taki was just equal as fun but some of me was pretty fun too hmm most time when I when a collab like this come and I'm low on gym I just pull for the characters and get the characters don't worry about you know getting them leveled up this is more of like a collector type thing. So, I'm gonna try for this real quick. Might do two pulls in this and two pulls after Taki, maybe? I wonder how close we are to the field. Ooh, we got one change there. Let's see what we're gonna get here. Okay, we got another option card, which we already had that one, I think. But having two of each option cards kind of is helpful, I guess. And we got a battle card selector. I don't really need this. As you can see, I have all the sets done. I have three of almost three of all those regular sets. Um. It would have been nice to like get tokens from this uh from this pool in, in general. Did we pull off this banner? Oh, that's value too. Okay, well, let's see guys. I'm going to see if we can get her. 
It's 900 for these. Well, I thought they used to be 800 for a pool. Got red. Change only one of you guys. One of you. Just. I just needed one of you guys to change, man. Alright, one more here. See yellow. Wait. Oh, I was gonna say, did we get like some type of thing there? Hey, you guys. Lounging over there. Lady Ashiro. She's so common on my account. I should have been a 6 there by now. I just have seen no reason with all the power creep and characters that are way stronger than these original characters. Like, as soon as EX characters release, I stopped touching my, my yellow characters, my, my purple character, border characters. You know, I started using the characters that I was pulling off the banners. Um. Man, there's just so many events after events that you don't have like, I need like a good two weeks of just straight farming and just getting, getting the stuff up that I can use to like upgrade my awakening. I'm guessing like buying packs is how people get stuff awakened so fast. Maybe it's just playing nonstop, I don't know. Uh, will I try again, guys? Might as well. I know I'm not going to be pulling again to the next collab or until a banner where a character comes that I actually want. Got nothing there. And it's our last pull, guys. Nothing. Unless. Nope, no fake out. Alright, guys. That's us wrapping it up, guys. If you have, you like, you got, if you see this video, you likely got 13 hours or less left. Get what you can and start saving for the next banner, guys. Uh, I was going to put this, this video out like two or three days ago, but. Like I said, it's just been busy, man. Life, life just like, you know, you, you do stuff, but sometimes life gets in the way of it. But um, I can show you my characters real quick. Let's go here. I'm just gonna show you the collab characters. Um, so a caliber collab characters. Oh, I got the color off. I think. Yep, I was, I was doing something earlier. Alright, we only have these two, and they're both uh, level 90. I'm not probably going to be able to do much with them at level 90. You know, I didn't get her um, special either, but here's what it is, guys. We might be able to get Ivy leveled up. If you didn't know, you can actually get her souls from different places. You just have to look around in this, in this event, and if you're able to go ahead and get those done, um... You should be able to get that. It's not in that one, it's in missions, I think. One is on the events. So you gotta do win 10 dream matches. So grinding the last hours of the event, you could possibly get those 10 wins out. You know, you play with your best characters that you have the most fun with, you know the combos. Throw them combos down. Be tactical, activate your um, interrupt when you need to. And bam, you know, you know, you've been wanting 10 matches, you know, and then after that, I want to say the other one is in the shop, the rust dungeon shop, which I've did a little bit of this, but I really haven't farmed it enough not to even get the set. I didn't even look at the set, honestly. It's a happy holiday set. Increase attack and increase active skill damage for 
when tagging Soul Calibur characters in. So it's a tag, one where you gotta be tagging them in and out pretty much. The person who's tagging in probably will get the advantage. It's not my type of set really, but I should have went on and got it. But I'm gonna try to go ahead and get her soul if I don't get anything else from this. As you can see, I bought out the Cassandra coins from here. So I can't buy those for my 500. I'm gonna have to get my last 500 of her coins from there. But right here, you can see items are gonna be expiring. That's gonna be our relay ticket expiring. The infinity box is expiring. The imprint boxes, the coins, the hammers, uh, the beginner badge fragment, the fairy cookies, which I haven't used those. I, I forgot about those actually. I just need to go and craft these up. Oh, uh, I only got one, enough for one. Go ahead and craft that. That's the from the crafting event. I wanted this box, but I don't even know where you get these pieces from. But anyway, guys, hope you enjoyed the the event, guys. The ones that y'all got to play. It. I didn't look at the play it that much, but it still was good, guys. It's great when we get the collabs here that we enjoy during the event, the, during <laughs> uh, the game. My soul. So. Guys, let me know if you enjoyed the collab and who's your favorite character out of Soul Calibur. It don't have to be any of the characters we got here, but leave that in the comments. And I'm going to take a look, guys. I'm going to be watching. And watch out for our new content coming, guys. I'm going to be playing some new games. I'll see you guys in the next video. Happy New Year's, by the way.